Hey, we got asked a question on one of our YouTube live chats about sliders and how do we get the dot pagination to actually sit on the left hand side, but not just on the left hand side, it also has to be vertical rather than horizontal. Look, what we have here is slides. There's nothing fancy going on here with it. It is just slides. And if you go to slider options, we're just showing the navigation as the dots. We're not showing the arrow and dots, just the dots. Don't worry about all the settings down here. But what we have here is, look, slider one, slider two, slider three. OK, can we get this as a vertical on the left hand side? Do you know what? Yes, you can. And you don't need a plug in or any fancy code. You do need code. But believe me, it is so simple. It might blow your mind. What we're going to do is go to advanced. We are going to go down to custom CSS and I have already dropped in a little bit of code for you here. Now, this code OK, is the identifier for the dots. OK, if you want to give if you want to go into your layout and put a class name so you're only ever touching the navigation dots for this slider, go ahead and be my guest. But right now, this is all we've done. Now, I'm going to drop into here three extra lines and the first one is going to surprise you. It's called width. OK, spell it right. Width. Uh, and then I'm going to go with zero pixel. Did you see what it did? Can you see it? Just by me adding that one little line where the width is now set to zero, so basically like a custom width, it's like literally moved. You see it move. It's like magic, right? Look, you literally see it go and then vertically up. Now we have to adjust it. So now I'm going to go in and I'm going to go with, uh, no, not left margin. Sorry, it's margin left. And we're going to go with 20 pixels like that. So I've now moved it away. So it's not completely up against it. And then what we're going to do is we will do, um, if I do bottom and I go with, uh, let's go with 45 VH, that's now moved. I mean, it's not completely in the middle. Let me just show you there, but it's actually in a reasonable area. Can you see that over there? So look, we start there, two, three, and you can jump back up and go wherever you want. Just look at the code. Width, zero pixel, margin left 20. And I could have gone, you know, I could have gone as crazy as I want. I could put it wherever I want, basically. You could start playing around with the position of this. I could even have this right at the top. So let's go with, um, well, 95 would put it, actually, that's way too high now, right? It's actually just up then. It's now creeping off the screen. But I've gone with 45 to position it there. But by three extra lines, we have got a vertical navigation. Literally, that's how simple and easy it was. But the key bit, and I cannot stress this enough, it was this bit here with the width. You take that out, and now your bars are now up there, which is in completely the wrong place. It was that, the custom width. I hope you like, subscribe, share, and follow. And of course, I'll see you. Never break, always fight, never quit. Do it right, play the game, win it life. Have no shame, there's no time. Feel the pain, let the grind. I could change in my mind. Pick a lane, commit and climb. The only way to win it life. I never miss that fact. Taking big swings, bitch, hand me the bat. Put me in the ring, you'll go out in a bag.